विगत कुछ वर्षों में कृत्रिम बुद्धिमत्ता एआई प्रौद्योगिकियों में तेजी से वृद्धि हुई है और डिजिटल यात्रा को तेजी से बदल रही है जनरेटिव एआई का उदय एआई अनुकूल प्रयोग में तेजी से अग्रिम कर रहा है और कई अग्रणी संगठन पहले ही जेन आई का उपयोग मामलों का अन्वेषण और निवेश कर रहे हैं जी संचालित उपद्रव के युग में प्रौद्योगिकी नेताओं को अपने ए के मुख्य भूमिका के प्रति पुनरावलोकन कर रहे हैं डिजिटलीकरण परिदृश्य में ए की परिवर्तक शक्ति डिजिटल नवाचार ग्राहक अनुभव कार्यात्मक प्रभावकारिता और परिपालन क्षमता को काफी बढ़ावा देने के समर्थन करने वाली है और यही वजह है कि अग्रणी सरकारें और डिजिटल युक्त संगठन एक ए हर जगह की ओर बढ़ रहे हैं for the entire society beside the point as i come from uh, being in consumer tech industry for very very long i uh, really foresee technology disruption happening in every possible industry and uh, obviously being participating here with idccio summit uh, it is one of a kind platform which gives you not just insight but a very uh, you make it very futuristic in terms of how uh, technology will shape up and um, I think uh, this is a learning uh, bed for us to come here and uh, collaborate with industry leaders in technology and uh, exchange ideas. That's about it. Yes. Uh, so myself, Nitin Bhatia, and uh, I am the director for operations and digital transformation with DPSGS Group. Uh, DPSGS basically is uh, into education. Uh, specifically, uh, you know, managing K-12 segment, and uh, we are a 43-year-old institution. Uh, so that's about us. Yes. Uh, Anything else you want to say? Um, so basically, uh, today we are participating in, uh, you know, as you see behind me, IDC CIO summit. Uh, this is uh, completely uh, industry collaboration on the, the new age technology as it is happening globally and is impacting India. And there's a lot for us to really look at is how uh, it's going to impact uh, education as a segment, as a sector. Uh, there is uh, already a lot of disruption, which is led by technology happening in this segment. And as uh, educationists, as a group which is focused on education, uh, we have to be forefront, we have to be abreast in terms of learning uh, and knowing possibly even before learning is knowing in terms of what is happening and what we need to know so that's about it yes